Hey everyone, BJ McDowell here. Today I'm going to do an unboxing. With that being said, we're gonna jump right in and open up this box. I literally just got it a few minutes ago. UPS man dropped it off. So we'll see what we have inside. Let's go. So just in keeping with the theme of things around here, we are gonna go ahead and unbox this fine unit on the back tailgate here of my truck. All right, so there it is. It's a much smaller box than in previous years. Today is November 13th, or Friday the 13th. So here we go, that's the box. It's iPhone 12 Pro Max. So this is the largest iPhone ever. And from what I understand, or seen online so far that this iPhone does not come with some of the normal things that you would expect and have had included in the box in the past. No headphones, no charging block, so the actual piece of the wire or plugs into the block and then into the wall, it's not included. So here we go, here's the phone back of the phone. It's really nice. This is the graphite color. This is also 256 gigabytes of storage on this phone. That's what the front looks like. Mute, unmute button. Always nice to have a physical button as opposed to one that you have to go inside and select. Uh, so first impressions, wow. Um, again, this is the graphite color. A little bit of texture on the back, very similar to the iPhone 11s. The sides are very shiny. I do see now where others have said it collects fingerprints. You can most certainly see how that can happen. Very cool. The screen is very nice, good size screen. It doesn't feel any heavier than the iPhone 11 Pro Max. It's got a nice stainless steel bezel. Speaker ports. Down there, it's where you plug in to charge. Again, that camera on the back is supposed to be where it's at. So the screen is supposed to be more resistant and impacts and things like that. So very nice, went ahead and got a case and did change it up. I typically go with a gray or black uh, but this is kind of the rubber case. It does have a felt-like material on the inside. And then along with that, there's this ring. I suppose that's the ring for the MagSafe connector pieces or different things that can go on the back of this case, as well as something to do with charging. But I'm going to go ahead and put the case on, see what that looks like for everybody. So there you go, case is on, very easy to do. I always go with the volume buttons on, in first. The lenses are pronounced very similar to the iPhone 11 Pro Max. It appears that it's a little bigger in this area, maybe they're a little more spread out. So I guess you could say everything about this phone is bigger. With that, thanks for tuning in for my unboxing. I've never done one of these before. Thought I would do it a little different and just kind of open up the box, get the phone out, and let you see what it's like and give you my first impressions. Thanks for joining in, and until next time, stay safe and take care.